Unit 1-6, question 2. Convert each of these mass measurements to its equivalent in kilograms. Number 1. Convert 1.47 grams to kilograms. Now, as we know, there are 1,000 grams in a kilogram. Therefore, we need to multiply 1.47 grams by 1 kilogram and divide that by 1,000 grams, like so. One thing to be aware of is that your units line up correctly in order to cancel out the grams and leave you only with kilograms as shown. Finally, we adjust our answer to have the correct number of significant figures, which in this case is 3. Number 2. Convert 11 micrograms to kilograms. First off, we know that there are 1 billion micrograms in a kilogram. Therefore, we must multiply 11 micrograms by 1 kilogram and divide the total by 1 billion micrograms as shown. Again, be aware that your units line up correctly so that when everything is cancelled out, you are only left with kilograms. Finally, we make sure that our answer has the correct number of sig figs, which is 2. Number 3. Convert 7.23 megagrams to kilograms. We are aware that there are 0.001 megagrams in a kilogram. Next, we multiply 7.23 megagrams with 1 kilogram and divide that by 0.001 megagrams. As always, we make sure that our units are all in line so that when everything is cancelled out, we are only left with kilograms. Our last step is to adjust our answer to have the correct number of significant figures, which in this case is 3. Number 4. Convert 4.78 milligrams to kilograms. Now, as we are aware, there are 1 million milligrams in a kilogram. Following this, we should multiply the 4.78 milligrams by 1 kilogram and divide that by 1 million milligrams. After that, we must make sure that our units again are properly lined up so that when we cancel out, we are only left with kilograms. Finally, we need to rewrite our answer so that we have the correct number of significant figures, for which this question is 3.